would happen if poor baby Abba accidentally ate this plastic bottle. And look, Maya's so sad. But don't worry, our girls are super intelligent and they know exactly what to do when they find pollution in their pool. Come on, Maya. Come on, Maya. What do we do with plastic? Right in the recycling bin. Great job, Maya. Come on, you guys, let her hear you. Well, Nelson, I don't know how we're ever gonna top a recycling sea lion. Well, Jimmy, the recycle was awesome, but I have a better idea. All right, let's hear it. What about some magic? Magic. Do you guys like magic? Yeah. Oh, come on, do you like magic? Yeah. All right, well, Ava here can make her entire head disappear. We need everybody's help to count along, though. Ava does not work for free. Are you guys ready? No, nobody's ready. Come on, are you guys ready? Ready! All right, here we go. One, two. Gone. You guys over here, pretend you're sitting up front. Tough crowd. All right, great job, Ava. Up next, Ava here can make this entire, or Maya here can make this entire fish disappear. I know it sounds impossible. She's been working on it pretty much her entire life. Do you guys want to see it? Yeah. yeah. All right, are you ready, Maya? Here we go. Stay right there. Wait for the magic. Abracadabra, gone. But <laughs> well, when you guys came to see a sea lion show, you expect to see them balance a ball on their nose, right? Yeah. I guess not. Come on, guys, right? Yeah. All right, well, Gouda here is going to give it a try. Most people think that it's a natural behavior for a sea lion to balance a ball. It's not. Look, I'll show you. Gouda's been working on it for quite a while, and this is how far we've gotten. Are you guys ready? Yeah. All right. Are you ready, Gouda? Here we go, balance. Great job, Gouda. Come on, you guys, make some noise for her. All right, you guys, up next is Maya here, our ball balancing pro. Come on, Maya, show them how it's done. Here we go. All right, great job, Maya. Show them what else you can do. All right, come on, you guys, cheer on. Come on, Maya. All the way back on your seat. Whoa. Good. All right, great job, Maya. That was absolutely awesome. No, Jimmy, that was not absolutely awesome at all. What do you mean that wasn't awesome? You guys liked it, right? Yeah. See, they liked it. Well, you see, they like it, but I don't like it because Maya was cheating the entire time. No, Maya doesn't cheat. Yes, she was cheating. Nelson, Maya is not a cheater. Look, why you don't just ask to her? Okay. Maya, were you cheating? No. <laughs> no. You know what? I think it's better you ask to Abba. Okay. Abba, was Maya cheating? <laughs> no, I don't understand. You're going to have to prove it. Okay, look, take the ball again and put it on Maya's nose. All right, look, she's not going to cheat. Look, you see? See what? Do it again, for. All please. right, one more time. <laughs> look, she's using her whiskers. Of course she's using her whiskers, silly. Whiskers are very important for sea lions. That's how they greet each other. That's how they find their fish in the dark and murky waters. And my favorite part, that's how I get all my fishy kisses. Can I have a kiss, Maya? How about you, Ava? Thank you. You know what, Jimmy? I want a kiss too. I'm not kissing you. <laughs> I don't want a kiss from you. I want a sea lion kiss. Maybe Maya will give you a kiss. Let me ask her. Maya, can Nelson have a kiss? No. no. Really, Maya? Maya, come on. Be nice. Give him a kiss. No. <laughs> not gonna happen. <laughs> you know what? I think it's better you ask to Ava. Ava. So will say yes. Will you give Nelson a kiss? No. Thank you, Ava. That was very sweet of you. Come on, you guys. Let's hear it for Ava.
You know what, Jimmy? I have a very good idea. All right, let's hear it. Why we don't play our girl's favorite game? Okay, which one? What about the ring toss? You're right, they love that game. Guys, these girls are great at catching rings, but they're terrible at counting them. We're gonna need everybody's help to count along. Are you guys ready? Yeah. Oh, come on, are you guys ready? Yeah. All right, here we go. Are you ready, Abba? One. Come on, everybody. Are you ready, Maya? Two. Here we go, Gouda. Three. Four. Five. And last one, hard one, Maya. Six. All right, great job, ladies. You know, Jimmy, you're gonna call me crazy, but I think I figured out why our girls are acting a little bit sassy today. You think you figured out why the girls are acting sassy? I'm listening. You see, early today I was here in the front and a kid came and asked me when he can take a picture with our seals. You're right, that does make our girls sassy. However, it is a common mistake, and with the help of the girls, we're gonna show you guys the differences between seals and sea lions. First off, our girls, sea lions, have cute little external ear flaps right on the sides of their heads. Show them those ears, girls. <laughs> Seals just have little tiny pinholes because they're pinheads, right, Ava? That's right. The second difference between a seal and a sea lion is that sea lions have big, long, strong front flippers. They can wave at everybody. Come on, you guys can wave back. They can see you. These front flippers are so strong. They can hoist their entire bodies up into beautiful handstands. Come on, girls. Come on, Guda. Good. This is very easy for them. And the last difference between a seal and a sea lion is what's called a rotating hip bone. Has anybody ever seen a seal move on land? All right, well, Ava here does an excellent seal impersonation. Come on, Ava. Seals don't have these big, strong front flippers or that big, strong, rotating hip bone. So they scrunch on their bellies like a caterpillar. Lucky for us, we have sea lions and they can walk on all four flippers just like this. Come on, Abba. And if they can walk on all four flippers, they sure can dance. You ready? Show them those dance moves. Come on, Abba. Here you go. Come on, you guys. Make some noise for us. Good job, Abba. All right. Great job, Abba. Let's hear it for one more time. All right, you guys, up next is our baby Gouda. Come on, Gouda, show them what you got. They got the papers and the trash. Oh, you don't get those spending cash. If you don't spend that kitchen floor, you ain't gonna rock and roll no more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't go back. Just finish cleaning up your room. All right, great job, Gouda. Let's hear it for our baby Gouda, guys. She's trying. Well, I bet you guys didn't know how well sea lions can move on land. And that's because we all know sea lions come from the sea. However, they do spend most of their time right here on land, just like you and I. They only go in the water to eat or to cool off because in the water lurks great danger. Who can tell me what's out there in the water? Shark. Oh, come on, you guys, what's out there? Shark. That's right, sharks and killer whales. And what do they think of our beautiful sea lions? Food. But don't worry, Maya knows exactly what to do if she finds a big, mean, great white shark in her pool. Come on, Maya. That's what you're gonna do, Maya? You're gonna splash those mean old sharks? That's not very scary or effective. You honestly look like you're drowning. But very cute for Maya. Come on, you guys, let's hear it for Maya.
Great job, Maya. Our show has come to an end. The only thing left to say is goodbye, Guda. Say goodbye, Guda. Goodbye, Maya. And goodbye, Ava. Now, if you guys like the show enough, we'll be offering the chance of a lifetime to have your pictures taken next to our beautiful sea lions. Nelson has all the details for you guys. We thank you all for coming and hope you have a great night.